Lieutenant. I was told Dave Ward has gone AWOL. Any idea where he is? Sorry, Cap. I haven't got the slightest clue. I see. This is bad. I have no choice but to declare him a deserter. I'm afraid there'll be gossip that you can't earn the respect of your men, and the Army's reputation will take another hit. Captain, all Aurora tunnels were destroyed. If they're gonna get back into the city, they'll have to come up with another way. I knew you wouldn't let me down, Lieutenant. Find Ryan and get your pay. It was well earned. Mutants are back to work, Captain. Well done, Lieutenant. Now go see Ryan and get paid. I warned you to keep your head down, Lieutenant. I don't know what you did, but Colonel Victor was having you tailed during your missions. And now, he's got a shitload to say about it. And none of it's good. I tried defending you, but the things he's saying... According to the Colonel, the level of violence you're bringing is... ...making it difficult for the mutants to accomplish their repair work. I know it sounds absurd to reason with them instead, but we need them, and your tactics are slowing our progress. I'm not there to be diplomatic, Captain. I'm there for a mission, which I accomplished, because the tough approach is all the mutants here. Maybe the fault's ours. Forgetting Technomancers aren't magicians. You can't work miracles. And if force produces results, minor delays are better than the rebellion we were otherwise facing. Victor also states you voluntarily jeopardized the lives of the officials you were charged with protecting. Want to explain that? How do I explain something that's not... If I put those officials' lives in more danger, I'd have been risking my men's lives and mine as well. Why would I do that? And the claims that you've been hiding vital intel for the sole benefit of your fellow Technomancers. Like an important research site on the Shadow Path of Aurora that didn't even register a line item in your reports? Captain, the only thing I've ever done is accomplish the missions you gave me. Nothing more, nothing less. Never concealed anything, or had any other interest but abundances at the forefront. This is unfair. I know what you've accomplished. Also know what he's saying. And even if he's not a fan of Technomancers, that alone wouldn't motivate him to make all this up to frame you. And the list of accusations and the details is long. Like your report on the deserters. Less truth than lies. Almost more lies than ink. Never would have expected it from you, Lieutenant. You flat out lied about Bulgakov! I can tolerate failure, Lieutenant, but lies are inexcusable! Do you take me for an idiot?! Captain, before we go any further, I'm gonna admit I haven't been fully honest in my mission reports. I wrote things to put myself in the best light, rather than take full responsibility for my mistakes. It was stupid, and disrespectful to you. But I never meant it like that, I assure you. Mistakes are one thing, Lieutenant. No soldier is perfect. Lies, though? Lies are another. You tried to protect your reputation with them, and instead, destroyed it. Maybe beyond repair. Quite a goddamn irony, isn't it? Well done. Unfortunately, he's already called you in and I can't stop it. All I can tell you is watch your mouth. Behave like the soldier you've been since you joined my company and you'll come out just fine. I'll plead in your favor if it comes down to that. Let's just hope it doesn't. Get going. The Colonel's waiting. Good luck. Hi. Lieutenant, how can I help you? Captain Eliza told me to come find you for my pay. Indeed, I've been expecting you. Here you go. Hi. 
Hi. Lieutenant, how can I help? 